Hi guys, I am outside a show home. I was just online and then the show, the internet went off so I had to start over. I'm gonna turn around so you can see the house. So this is in Cranston. Woo, it's gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Yeah. Remember by the dump? Mm -mm. You don't remember the price. No. $700,000. Oh really? Oh my lord, and that place doesn't even smell smell that great. So this is the garage. Right? They're using the garage as an office. So this is the show home. Look at how gorgeous it is. Oh, this floor is quite nice. Yeah, so this is the front entrance. This is the front entrance. So you come in. There is a bench there. Right? And then, this is the closet. <laughs> wow. And this is the powder room. Right? This is the guest bathroom. It's, it's quite nice. Look at the chandeliers. They're absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So this is the... Um, the mud room. So this is where the garage will be. So this is the garage door. Come through the garage door. And then this is the mud room. And do they do have a boot room? Look at that. It's gorgeous. I just turn the light on for you. You can put your shoes, everything there. Isn't this beautiful? I think this is about a 10 foot ceiling. Yeah. And then through the mud room, you can go so if you come with your groceries you can go to the kitchen so this is like a little butler um what they call this a butler pantry right look at that guys this is the kitchen oh oh my lord this is awesome i like this style i like the white look i like it it's nice i also like the gas stove I like the um, the cupboard. I like the wood fan. This is a wood fan. Yeah. Let me see what they're using. Yeah, they have a good fan. So look at that. And the fridge. Oh my God, this is to die for. Look at that, guys. This is a beautiful fridge, stainless steel. It's a built-in fridge. Mm -mm -mm. And then they have kitchen aid. How can you put a kitchen aid into a million dollar home? That don't make sense. Yeah. Yeah. What kind of what what's the um what's the name of this fridge? Oh, it's a decor. How can you put a decor? Because this fridge is quite expensive. With a kitchen aid. They cheap out right here. And then them have a decor. Um stove top anyways guys it still look good yeah you have to know your stuff like me i know my stuff i know what look good and what don't look good yes guys look at that this is wonderful you know you notice the openness in the um this is quite beautiful that is nice and this is the front entrance you would come from the front entrance let me go back because i just came in through the Right, so this is when you come up the front entrance, this is what you would see. It's a nice open concept. Look at that, guys. It's gorgeous. It is absolutely beautiful. Mm. So this is the office. So all of you guys who are working from home, you'd be living in luxury. Look at that. The office, the office is fully equipped. This is nice. And then this room is so sunny. So this is actually a south facing lot because look at how bright it is in this room. This is the living room, living room, dining area. This is the dining area, right? And this is when you're looking back on the, um, the kitchen area. It's quite sunny. Very, absolutely. I'm going to go outside so that you can see the, um, so that you can see so you're facing this is the this is right look at that 
it's a new area guys in cranston in right and so there's a river behind you right this is outside you're on the deck oh my lord i close the people them door yeah mm -hmm. look at that it's well well equipped guys what's the price on this house 1.7 million dollar guys yeah the hardwood so i'm going back into the butler um, pantry the hardwoods are quite nice look at that the door yeah and then you have all kind of cupboard space there guys you're full of cupboard space you can put all kind of junk in there where you don't need right it is fully equipped it's gorgeous 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 look you have a sink they have um, the gold, the gold handles, the gold, um, they choose gold and it complements the, um, the lighting fixtures. All of it is gold. Look at that. The, the thing I had to come back to guys, I have to wonder why would they choose $1.7 million and use a kitchen aid with decor and the fridge's decor. I can't even think about it. The developer, the cheap out. Anyways, we're gonna go upstairs now. I like these stairs, stairway. It is beautiful. It's not carpeted, which is absolutely gorgeous, actually. Hi. Hi. Yeah, nice. It's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, so when you come up the stairs, this is your bonus room. Or your lifestyle room, if you want to call it that. It's absolutely gorgeous. Look here. Mm -mm -mm. It is beautiful. Woo! Right, you have your TV. It's quite small, though, you know, guys. It's not the biggest, but yeah, it's nice. Then you have your come up, come up, and then you come. There's a hallway here. I guess that's the master bedroom. Let us go into the, the laundry area. So this is the laundry area, guys. Fully equipped. Fully equipped. Everything you need. You can just fill it a dirty clothes and close the door. This is the hallway to the, the other three bedrooms. So bedroom number one, quite small because it's only a arm. Um, you only have a crib in there yeah and then you have a walk-in closet that overlook the front the, the front of the house or down the street yeah small and then this is the other room the room number two bedroom number two it has a nice walk-in closet and it overlooked the um the front of the, the street, the front street. It's quite big. This one is quite, it's a bigger room. I think this is a queen size bed. And it have two um, nightstands. So it's good. You have a seating area. So it, it's, it's quite a big room, actually. And I like the decor and I like the window. See the window? And this is the main bathroom. Right? So you have three bedroom, one bathroom here. Right, you have two sinks. One, sink number one, sink number two. Wow. And then you can close the door if somebody wants to use the bathroom or wants to use the sink, you can close the door, the bathroom door, and have some privacy. That is quite good. Oh my lord, I love the tile. Guys, do you see the pink tile? No man, the pink tile is taking life. And I like the floor. Love this floor. I love the finishing. I'm, I'm so pleased that they take the same finishing from downstairs, upstairs. And then you have wall-to-wall -wall tile that makes it even gorgeous, right? And then I like the pictures on the wall here. And look, look at the floor. It's quite light. I, I kind of like it. It's tastefully. It's tasteful. So let us look at the... Um, 
So it, that, that was only two bedroom, guys, not three. So it was the bathroom. So it's a two bedroom house. Ah. So this is the master bedroom. Look at that. I don't know. They have the coffin ceiling in there. I don't know if you guys can see the coffin ceiling. Yeah, but there's a coffin ceiling there. And there is double door entering the master bedroom. See, there is double door, that, which is good. You feel like a king and a queen. Right? So the area is quite big. It's not um, truck top. And then you have, yeah, it's a queen. It's a king size bed. And you have two oversized night nightstand yeah so it's quite big and you look over you overlook the river it's nice and you can draw in here is quite sunny i can feel the heat mm -mm. so this is the master bedroom the master um, bathroom i like the tile actually it's quite gorgeous look at that they have everything matching now this is the shower and I like how they bring the light, the light tile in here. It almost matches the cupboard. See? Mm -hmm. Floor. Yeah. They did good. Look at that. Wow, guys. $1.7 million. Anyways, $1.7 million these days is nothing in comparison so you have your own toilet and you have your is and hers sink right so you can know which one of you guys is more messy than the other see that one sink number one sink number two you have the tub in the middle and you have the shower over there the lighting fixtures aren't bad it's nicely decor in here is quite hot and then this is the master bedroom closet. So I think you have the is and hers. So this must be the her, right? Quite big. Mm-hmm. It's nice. Nice, nice. Built-in um. Built-in cabinetry, and then you have the meal over here. Of course, you don't get any anything really. And then you have something to hang your dresses here. And then, guys, you can go into the home. Um, you are now in the um, laundry room. Look at that. That's the laundry room. So you enter the master closet. You can leave from the master closet straight into the laundry room. And then you do have towel rocks and things where you can hang your stuff. This is quite a neat idea. Actually, when you fold the clothes, you can actually leave them there, which is absolutely a good idea. I like it. Because oftentimes you fold the clothes and nobody wants to pick them up. Right? And as I said, the floor is absolutely gorgeous. Right? They have a little bonus room upstairs. Right? They have the open to below, to the front entrance. It's not bad. I have window. It is quite and a lot of light coming in. They spare no expense when it comes to the window. I like homes like that. Right? Absolutely beautiful. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, guys. This is in Cranston. Man. Seven, how much? $1.7 million. Wow. No expense spared. Spared. Yes, see here, see there, guys, see there. Mm -hmm. This is the living room. This is my favorite. I could just stay down here all day, all night. Look how open this is. This is an open concept. They have the fireplace here, and then they have. I showed you guys this already, but I just love it. I have to come and give you a 360. So you come from the front entrance. And then you either go upstairs or you go downstairs in the basement. We haven't gone to the basement as yet. And then this is the, the office. If you work from home, this is fabulous. Then you have the living area, right, with a fireplace, right? And it's of open, it is open windows all through that back wall. And then you have the, um, the dining area. And then you have the big island here in the kitchen. 
And then this is the kitchen area, right? So absolutely gorgeous, look at that. So guys, I'm gonna go down, look. And the tile is, the, um, the island is so pretty. It is absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna go downstairs now, right? So I'm going into the basement. Guys, this is the basement. <laughs> oh, the wind. You know what? It is quite wide. This basement don't feel like a like oh it's a it's a walkout basement. So you come down in the basement. This is a storage area. You can store all of your things them where you don't need. Yep. All your things them that you don't need. Let me see this room is what. This is another storage where you can put your um, towels and anything you want to reach quickly. And then this is your furnace area. Guys, look here. A two for, oh, let me see how many furnaces them have in here. They have two. Yeah, them have two furnaces. Two furnaces them have, guys. And them have the water pipe. Them have the heat. Oh, everything is brand new. And see there, oh my God, they have the humidifier. They have everything. Look. Mm -mm. Wow. This is it, guys. This is it. This is all the guys. Every one of the guys, them, look. This is your playground zone. Right? Yeah, this is in the furnace room. Right, so that is the stairs you come down. This is the... um the storage area and then you go straight or you turn more to the to the right there is a bathroom and a bedroom so this is the downstairs so we're in the in it's a walkout basement right so i don't like to say basement i have to say walkout basement because it is you can um, exit down here look tile is beautiful i like the dark tile honestly i do not like um tub inset oh my this is even this is heated tile yeah it is a heated tile down here one sink that's me guys hi this is charade anyhow yeah there you go this is the bedroom downstairs you notice how they put a big window downstairs so down here don't feel like the basement it's I and mean, this is a queen size bed with two small um side table which is which is good and you have a a closet a big size closet it, i don't know it's not a walk-in closet but it's big enough you have a huge window down here right so now right we're gonna go into the air into this area oh this is a wine cell yeah this is a wine cell guys so my you this is a wine cellar if some of you guys drink a lot, this is ideal. If not, I mean, I don't know what you're going to do with this space. It's kind of an odd space, to be real honest. Right? But it's to the side anyways. It's for decoration. What is that? What is that? Oh, guys, look at that. You have electric blind. You can open up the blind and close it look at that no man this house is very techy you see that look <laughs> what oh yeah yeah i like the curtain rod anyways this is the downstairs look guys you can walk and you can come down here and you feel like you're not in the basement you feel like you're you know you're just two step away from outside and every which way you go into this house you can see the river is it river they call it here i don't think them call it river is whatever guys i come from jamaica anyhow oh look at this isn't those pictures on the wall beautiful I like the design so the bedroom let me let me let me um stand stand look window all the way disappear no expenses because those double wide doors are expensive mm-hmm and then them have um on the in the ceiling them have light every which way 
every which way guys it really let me stand over here so you can get a good look at the um the room down in the basement your entertainment room in the basement it's a lot of light coming through it's a south facing yard i don't know it's good when you're living in a cold country to have a south facing backyard okay you can go around there and it's sunny all day yeah this as i said i don't know what this is for so guys we're gonna go upstairs now and we're gonna try talk to the people who sell in the house and ask them how many square feet is the house. It's 2,000, 3,000 square feet. Yeah. Guys, this is something to do. This is absolutely gorgeous. I have to take a look at one last look at the living room again. The living room, the dining room, and the kitchen. It's beautiful. Beautiful. Right? And you can see it's open concept. Them have um, coffin ceiling all throughout the life. In light, lighting fixtures are beautiful. The stove is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I'm going back downstairs. And them have open to below. Right? It's gorgeous. $1.7 million. Your money have to be up there. Right, this is the you come in from the closet from the um the garage, and this is what you do. You put your stuff down, and the pantry is there, and then you have the um the boot room. It's gorgeous, it's gorgeous. If you're just joining us, you can go and look back at the video. Yeah, and this is the garage. They're using the garage for our office at the moment. How many car garage is this? Three? Yeah. It's a three car garage. How many square feet is this house? Um, okay. right, so I think that's the four so it's 3,070. So then since we developed the basement, it adds 1,054, so we're just over 4,100. So 4,100 square feet, guys, guys, guys. Right? This is the main level. So the triple car garage, the foyer, that is when you come in, right? And then you have the mud room. The serving pantry, walk-in pantry, kitchen, you know, and they're all the back deck and they have this big deck. It's beautiful. And the bonus room upstairs, the owner's suite. Yes, sir, I take it. You take it through all of it. Yeah, come on down. It's called Lusa. It's gorgeous, gorgeous, beautiful. Anyhow, guys, I am, I am leaving. This is Shabri. <laughs> I need a million dollar house like this, right? Yeah, I do. Anyways, guys, I'm going to go to another showroom because this is what I'm doing today. I need exercise, so I need to do something.